left wincing in discomfort after Alastair Cook suffered a nasty blow during the afternoon session of day two in Cardiff. Oh, that's hitting where you don't want to get hit. That's a nasty one, that. Anderson was bowling at speeds approaching 140 kilometres an hour when the ill-directed Stephen Smith edge floored the England captain. Whoa. And despite some of his teammates failing to grasp the severity of the injury... There you go, there's your vice-captain. Cook was forced from the field to receive yeah, treatment. Walk. He's going off. The hit crashed the 30-year-old captain back down to earth after he had held on to remove David Warner just three balls before. Edge, oh, good catch. Alistair Cook, that's a ripper, that. Better be warned. Sport hurts. Michael Clark certainly felt this. Action from Australia against South Africa on the way. A little later on as well. Well, he's been cracked there in a very delicate place in the upper groin. Quick one. Oh gone down like a sack. It's floored him. That's painful. But we can all see the funny side of this, but Chadwick Walton clearly does not. That's painful. Painful indeed. <laughs> Dear. <laughs> if you want more of something to think about now. Oh, that was a wicked blow. Oh, that's hitting. Oh, it's a nasty one. Now, that wasn't on the, on the head, I don't think. Now, where's that struck him? What's in favour of Jacques? Reynolds! And oh, he's got the umpire. Man down. Oh! I'll tell you what, that's really serious, I reckon. That's got a flush. It's been smashed. Oh, dear. That's really serious, I reckon. Where it's Let's have a look. He laced it. He's absolutely smashed it. Oh! 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 Goodness! Oh! I suspected it might have been there. Last ball passed over. Yeah. It was a boom boom. It was a single boom. Still a ginger. Let's hope they're not bringing out the magic spray. I don't think you need the magic spray. <laughs> Just some loving. You talk of bat manufacturers, though. The funniest I saw prior to Boo Boo was the Murphy Slogger. Nick County brought out the Murphy Slogger. Yeah, that was good. I had a picture of him with a long mullet as well. And I, I remember coaching a under 16 Dowling team at St Kilda Cricket Club. And they weighed about two pound twelve as well. There's these fourteen and fifteen year old kids, kids trying to swing it. They kept getting bowled. They won it all with the Merv Hughes slogger. They weighed nearly three pounds. It was a sleeper. <laughs> Is Boom Boom a bat manufacturer? Who actually makes a Boom Boom? I just think it's the name of the bat. I don't, I don't know. I think you have to be a licensed bat manufacturer these days to produce. So maybe there's a new company called Boom Boom. As Muhammad Sam is surely crying, and they're not going boom boom. 